स्क्रीन शेयर हो तो नहीं करा गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन आई एम गायत्री टूडे अवर टॉपिक दी टॉपिक इज कोलेस्ट्रॉल बायोसिंथेसिस लेट्स सी दी व्हाट्स दी कोलेस्ट्रॉल कोलेस्ट्रॉल स्ट्रक्चर बायोसिंथेटिक पाथवे एंड मेटाबॉलिक रेगुलेशन हैव टेस्टेड दी इन इंजीनियरिंग ऑफ केमिस्ट बायोकेमिस्ट्स एंड सेल बायोलॉजिस्ट ऑफ फॉर ओवर 100 इयर्स द लास्ट सेंचुरी बिगन विद दी फाइनिंग वर्क ऑफ हेनरीच वीलैंड हु रिड्यूस्ड दी स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ कोलेस्ट्रॉल एंड बाइल एसिड्स How was such a complex molecule synthesized by the cell? Investigation into the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway required the development of isotopic tracer methods in Rudy lab in the 1930s. Using these novel techniques, showed that the ring structure and side chain of cholesterol were derived from acetate. By the 1980s, the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway was understood to be a complex pathway for of over 40 cytostatic and membrane-bound enzymes, which was subjected to feedback regulation by the end product, cholesterol and oxygenated forms. Uh, next, the structure and biosynthetic overview of the cholesterol. Metabolic and transport pathways that control cholesterol levels in mammalian cells. Cholesterol is synthesized from acetyl CoA and a four key enzymes that regulate cholesterol synthesis are indicated. Cells also obtain cholesterol by uptake and hydrolysis of LDLs, cholesterol esters. Products derived from cholesterol or intermediates in pathway include bile acids, oxysterols, cholesterol esters, and non-steroidal isoprenoids, and delivered to the SD late endomyosis and lysosomes. where hydrolysis of the core cholesterol esters occur the cholesterol that is released is transported throughout the cell normal mammalian cells tightly regulate to cholesterol synthesis and ldl uptake to maintain cellular cholesterol levels within narrow limits and supply sufficient isoprenoids to satisfy mat- metabolic requirements of the cell regulation of cholesterol biosynthetic enzymes takes place at the level of gene transcription mrna stability translation enzyme phosphorylation phosphorylation enzyme takes place levels on gene transcription mrna stability translation enzyme phosphorylation and enzyme degradation cellular cholesterol levels are also modulated by cell of cholesterol esterification by acetyl coa the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway take a closer at the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway focusing on the enzymes that are regulated sterol regulated sterols are synthesized from the two carbon bound building block acetyl coa the soluble enzyme acetyl coa thiolase interconverts to acetyl coa and acetyl acetyl coa which are then condensed by 3 hydroxy 3 methyl glutaryl synthesis to form hmg coa from involved in ketogenesis predominance involved in ketogenesis predominance in their liver in extra fatty tissue the most abundant form is a soluble enzyme that is highly regulated by supply of cholesterol hmg coa reductases catalyzes the reduction of hmg coa to malonate utilizing two molecules of nadph hmg coa reductase is 97 kda hmg coa reductases the rate determining enzyme of the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway and like hmg coa synthesis is highly regulated by supply of cholesterol thus the enzyme has received intense scrutiny and therapeutic target for treatment of hypercholesteremia 
the enzyme is inhibited by a class of pharmacological agents generally called stains which have an hmg like moiety and a bulky hydrophobic group melvonin is metabolized to francely disophosphate a series of enzyme localized peroxidase first mevalonic kinase phosphorylate the 5 hydroxy group of mevalonic acid the enzyme is a homodimer of 40 kda that is subjected to feedback inhibition by several isoprenoid intermediates the product of melvonic kinase melvonate 5p is then phosphorylated to form melvonic acid which is decarboxylated and dehydrated by melvonate pp decarboxylase to form isoprenyl pp enzyme is a part of a large family of prenyl transferases that synthesize the backbone for all isoprenoids including cholesterol steroids prenylated proteins heme yet sequence synthesis is a the synthesis the enzyme condenses two molecules the first committed step in cholesterol synthesis the enzyme condenses two molecules of ferrulanes pp and then reduces the intermediate to form squalenes a larger n terminal catalytic domain faces the cytosol and core to a membrane by a c terminal domain the orientation may allow the enzyme to receive the hydrophobic substances substrates from the cytosol and release the hydrophobic product into the endoplasmic and the structure seen in the picture squalenes is converted into the first sterol lanosterol by the action of squalenes epixoidase and oxidosqualene silase where does cholesterol synthesis takes place all of the enzymes that convert acetyl coa to formanel pp have formazel pp have classically been thought of a cytosolic enzyme with the expedition of hmg coa reductase HMG CoA reductase is one expedition to the rule. Immunocytochemistry and immunobloating have localized HMG CoA reductases to both the endoplasmic reticulum and preoxymos. Additional evidence for the involvement of peroxymes in cholesterol biosynthesis come from analysis of diseases of peroxymal deficiency. It is not clear why cholesterol synthesis in a comparative rule and requires intermediates to cycle between peroxymos and the cytosol it is also uniclear why some of diets to cycle between pre- peroxymos and cytosol some of the enzymes are found in multiple compartments and others are slowly in endoplasmic reticulum or peroxisomes as noted the cholesterol synthesis is a very complex process and compartmentalization may represent another level of regulation Cholesterol synthesis is essential for norm- normal development and maintenance of tissue that cannot obtain cholesterol from plasma lipoproteins such as brain the biosynthetic pathway supplies non steroids isoprenoids that are required by all cells thus it is not surprising that metabolic defects in the cholesterol biosynthetic pathway have devastating consequences The first recognized human metabolic defect in the biosynthesis of cholesterol and isoprenoids was malvonic aciduria. Clinical features of malvonic aciduria include failure to thrive, anemia, gastroenteritis like that. Activity which is postulated at the compensate for the low malvonate kinase activity. as a second metabolic defect in cholesterol synthesis leads to smith limmel opchi syndrome slo is is a relatively common osteotomer receives disorder severely severely reduced cholesterol synthesis is a predicted to have severe consequences on development of the fetus because cholesterol is only obtained from the maternal circulation during the first trimester In addition the brain is predicted to be severely affected because plasma lipoproteins cannot cross the blood brain barrier and most if not all cholesterol needed for the brain growth is synthesized locally patients with slos have mental retardation and microphilia which is constant while cholesterol synthesis being required for normal brain development clinical features also include failure to thrive and characteristic craniofacial skeletal and genital anomalies
and the future directions 50 years ago it was recognized that the hepatic cholesterol synthesis was subjected to feedback regulation by dietary cholesterol only in the last decade have the mechanism been educated for transcriptional and degradative regulation of the rate limiting enzyme both transforms of regulation require that proteins sense the local cholesterol concentration rising cholesterol levels cause hmc coa reductase to be uh, degraded by the protosome the cause scap the remain localized to the endoplasmic reticulum rather than translocate in the ch the challenge ahead is determine how hmg coa reductase and scap transduce the signal of increased cellular cholesterol content into action and this is the synthesis of cholesterol and the introduction to the cholesterol metabolism. Thank you to all.